yes uh, welcome to our today's demonstration video yeah we wish to demonstrate about what is called a hand pump yes or a manually operated water pump yes i am by names of kabanga james i work as a water resources engineer with waste engineering limited yeah today we are going to see the different okay the main components of a hand pump and how they work yeah we first came here uh, to do to find the best drilling point yeah our hydrogeologist and his team came and find this spot then our drilling team came and drilled here uh yeah after drilling we did what we call pump testing then after pump testing we are here at the last stage of this well yes um we're going to talk about the components of a handy pump um how it works yeah how it works is that after installation someone uses his energy yeah he uses hand yes that is why it's called a handy pump you use hand to you generate energy from your hands then you pump you 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 use a handle to pump out water from down there that's why it's called a hand pump yes one of the components yeah we are going to start with uh, what we can see on top one of the components is the handle yeah or a pump handle yes yes with the, where someone holds with hands yeah from the pump handle we go to the tank this is called a water tank yeah where water collects and then comes through this nozzle uh yeah from 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 this member from the water tank you come to what we call a pedestal this is the pedestal yeah this member provides support and also the required height say so that when you put your jerry can it fits very well yeah now inside uh show you how it looks like inside yeah we, we shall come to that okay how it looks inside yes uh let me open here yes inside we have we have this chain we have this chain so we are going to see this chain connects to the connecting road we are going to see the connect connecting road and uh, other parts. now the connecting road the connecting road this is uh, an example of a connecting road or oh, this is a connecting road connecting road its use is to uh to connect up to this member this member is called a cylinder so you connect dif uh, you connect different pieces of these members up to the cylinder inside so that when you pull this handle these connecting rods move but they move through a length equal to almost equal to the length of the of the of the cylinder so these ones they are used to pull water from down yes like this um now there, there are different types this is uh, a stainless steel connecting rod the advantage of a stainless steel connecting rod is that it doesn't rust yes for all the years it will not last but other types like uh, galvanized iron and brass yeah they have that limitation after some time they do rust and uh, yeah if it goes worse you may see the rust some brown color in the water yes um yeah one of the limitation of stainless steel is that it costs some money more than other materials type like the brass and the galvanized iron so this is uh, the connecting rod now the connecting rod moves inside through a pipe yeah, inside through a pipe. 
this is uh, a pipe yeah it is also stainless steel uh there are also different types like uh, galvanized iron brass the advantage of um, other types is that they cost less in terms of money but the limitation is that they do rust yeah because they're underwater they, some of the roads will be completely in the water zone yes um yeah this is the pipe so you connect different pieces of pipes up to the depth you need how do you determine the depth is through the pump testing data that has to be done yeah um yeah the, the, the types of pipes is the plastic pipe yeah this is an example of a plastic pipe yes uh the advantage is that it's lightweight um it doesn't rust but the limitation is that it is limited on installation depth yes yeah uh yeah we shall see how water will be coming out yes yes uh we have successfully installed our handy pump and uh we are going to pump out water and we see how it is coming yes please start pumping water yeah this is the water coming out from down so as we said that you use your you use your energy you use your hands so this gentleman is using his hands to move this play system to pull water through the connecting rods we saw and that water is in the pipes that we also saw so uh yeah this is how it is coming yes so people here they are going to enjoy this water yeah thank you for watching in case you have any questions don't hesitate to contact us and uh, we are also we shall also be happy in case uh for any advice uh for any information for any education yeah we always we are always willing to learn more to learn from other people uh yeah to make this world of engineering a better world and also to have the best service to those who entrust us with the work yeah thank you very much uh in case you want to watch more videos you can go to our youtube channel we have several videos there uh, about different things